Chris. My last name's not Barry. My stepdad's last name is Barry. We decided it would be a good name to use uh, for the band. Without you, I just can't do it all, and I suppose you know I'm talking about Holy Actually, my first real band in which we make our own music. My stepfather, he teached me to sing out loud in church, and my real dad is this amazingly rhythmic person that really knows how to bring to life what he feels in music, in this especially Cuban music. So I'm the singer of the band, consisting of a guitarist and a double bass player, a trumpet player who also does the flugelhorn, and we have a very interesting percussionist, so we're not working with a drummer. And it's a very interesting group. In 2008 uh, was when I started um, singing in this traditional New Orleans band and it was quite an eye-opener for me. I really, really thought it was fun. But then in 2010 I met Paul and so we basically started this band. Well, I met Chris at a jam session and I heard her sing a, a song that she made with somebody else and I was really impressed by the sound of her voice firstly. I thought, wow, if she writes her own songs and this could be interesting project to, to be involved with. I'm just as hungry for you, I can't deny So I'm to belly it inside my frame of mind I think inspiration is in uh, everything, almost everything. I've been inspired by my grandmother. I've been inspired by the fact that um, where I come from, you get so much musical information from different kinds, different places. I was really surprised because she uh, had so, such a lot of interesting influences that I, lots of things that I didn't know myself. I think our music can't be new, really new. I mean, it has new elements to it because it's a new direction we bring to music that inspires us. Never could think you'd be the one I'd see Today's a day for loving Cause there's something about the way you look at me behind marbles is well it reflects the the love we have for the southern music um, and there's a southern saying that goes you've lost your marbles or you've got a hole in your bag of marbles and it means something like you've lost your mind our music is definitely danceable and no you don't have to be a professional dancer to be able to um, make a move on our music but um, I really think it's um, it swings in many ways um, since it's a you know a combination of different influences. Yeah. 